Hey guys, welcome to Strobe Training. Today we're going to do a little opening of, uh, if you have any questions, strobetraining.com. You can reach me, Mike, at strobetraining.com. So today we have the, uh, the Strobe Sport Plus Tactical Glasses. So we're going to open this up. And inside, first thing you see, a little QR code. So I suggest you click on this, check out the video, a little introduction there. Take the glasses out. I like to be neat, put that box away. All right. I'm going to have this beautiful clamshell case, hard shell case to protect the glasses. Open them up. And here we go. So we got some goodies here, some more information with the cards. We do have the dust rag to clean it. We have the USB cable, which will uh, fit into here, or you get any, any USB outlet that you can charge your glasses with. And uh, through the charging, see there's a little gasket right here. Try this flip open. You put it in there and charge it. Once you're done, seal that gasket again, put it back. So you can see the tactical, Sport Plus tactical has this strap, and then it also has a little added bonus, these temple arms. So you can swap out the straps for the temple arms and look something like this. So if you don't like the strap, you can do this. Temple arms will bend down, all right, and it'll fit in your box. So but I have the one with the strap out right now, so we'll do that. Uh, a couple of things about it. We have the, the this high, highly rated ballistic plastic with the shooter's tint. So let me turn them on. We hit the M button. It's a plus. Uh, M is for mode and for power, so hold it down by about one, two, three. Boom, there we are. We're working. Let's get this out of the way here. Okay, so we're looking at here, we started, the B9 is where the battery level is. B9, it goes up to F, which is full, and down to B0, when we need to charge, or LP, you'll say for low power. So a 07 is 70 milliseconds of occlusion, is how long the lenses go black or go opaque followed by 100, 100 milliseconds of clarity. So we push the button and we'll keep going up a level. So now it's 100 milliseconds, 130 milliseconds, 160, 190. All right, still 190, 19, 220, 250, 280, 310, 340, 370. So this is at the highest level of occlusion that they have and so you can see my hand underneath there um, again this is something where um, it, it's going to be much more difficult there might not be a whole lot of training you do at this level but uh, you can definitely work on balance type of exercises something you want to learn your body and your feel so uh, let me go through the modes real quick so the m is also mode so i will push the m let me go go forward back to the 07 so the low level all right and uh, right now I pushed it so it is, I've got one lens out and then one. So what I have here is this, this is for the uh, right lens. So the right lens is blinking, the left lens is opaque. Why we want to do this, this is so we can work on our weak eye. We can make this weak eye give the brain better info. The brain wants to succeed and it will find a way. But the brain is lazy, it doesn't want to have to work. We're we going to make it work and give your brain better info. We hit it again. We change the mode. Now we change it to the other eye. So let's say this is your dominant eye. Now we can work this weak eye. I'll hit it one more time. It goes back to both. And a couple of things. So we got the strap. We got the arms. And this nice highly rated ballistic plastic with the shooter's tint. And there's 11 different levels of training. So um, good luck training with these guys. Don't forget to use that single eye. Whatever drills you may do, challenge the brain and it will adapt and get better. If you have any questions, uh, go to strobetraining.com. There's a comment section to contact me or you can email mike at strobetraining.com. Good luck in your training, guys. We'll talk to you soon.